In this question, Amy and Kate have each caught three fish. And the weights of the fish are given to the nearest tenth of a kilogram. Now the sum of Amy's fish is currently 16.3 kilograms. And the sum of Kate's fish is 16.1 kilograms. However, the question sh says, show how Kate's fish could actually weigh more than Amy's in total. Now, these totals here have assumed that these were the accurate exact measurements, but these were given to the nearest tenth of a kilogram. Now, in the worst case scenario, Amy's fish could have been less than this. Now, Amy's fish could have been 6.75 kilograms because that rounds up to 6.8. This could have been 4.25 kilograms. Again, that rounds to 4.3. And this one could have been 5.15 kilograms. Again, that rounds to 5.2. So her fish could actually have been less than we thought. And the total of these three fish might be less than Kate's so let's have a look. 6.75 plus 4.25 plus 5.15. Ah, 16.15. That's still higher. However, these fish here were also rounded to the nearest tenth. So 8.2 could have been as high as 8.3, 8.25. Three point four could have been as high as three point four five, and four point five could have been as high as four point five five. And if we add those three together, we get sixteen point two five. So if Amy's fish weighed their least possible weight with this given rounding, and Kate's fish weighed their max possible weight then Kate's fish are indeed heavier than Amy's by 0.1 of a kilogram.